Hi, it's Michelle Tennant Nicholson. I'm here um, on April Fool's Day and I'm doing a treadmill desk update on my weight loss efforts for 2011. And I'm really excited. I mean, I would love to say this is an April Fool's, but it's not. This morning, I just got back from the gym and uh, last Saturday I became a spinning I was certified to do spinning um, at the University of North Carolina in Charlotte, and my gym manager knew that I was getting my certification, so today, on the ride that she calls The Beast, um, she teaches spinning for us Friday mornings at 6 a.m., she invited me to co-teach. And I'm just, on, I'm just on an incredible high. I, uh, uh, I'm really in love with spinning. It's making a huge difference with my health. In fact, I don't think I've talked too much about my scoliosis, but I had such um, severe scoliosis. I'm 41, and so in my late 30s, it got really bad because I was sitting so much as my company grew, and it got to the point where I had to brace myself to sit down, you know, even in the bathroom. Like, I had to, like, brace myself because my back was in so much pain. I went to a chiropractor to help me you know, with the adjustments, but for a while there I was getting two or three adjustments a week just to cope with the pain, doing a lot of massage and pain management. But none of the exercises, like I would run, I would do lots of things, you know, I did, I've done triathlons and marathons and stuff, but nothing's ever let me, you know, keep my, body, my back in health. And the other thing is, is that it's real important to not have extra weight on you when you have scoliosis, but the problem is that you get in so much pain and then you get it like you don't feel like working out because you're in so much pain and, you know, blah, 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 blah. So, but this year in only, since, you know, so now it's April 1st, so since January, spinning has stabilized my core and now the pain is like, you know, I only have like a little tweaky part in my neck, but my chiropractor says that my, you know, that my back is staying in alignment, which is, I don't think I've ever had that. So that's why I got really inspired to go ahead and get my certification, learn more about spinning so that I can even spin at the gym, even when there's not a spin instructor there. But also, you know, I'm not, uh, I, just, I just love it. So I told them, oh, you know, if you need me to sub, I will. And so they're already picking me up on that. I mean, I don't even have my cleats yet or, you know, I just have like the stuff that I work out in. So. I thought I would share that. Also, my weight is staying the same. I haven't lost any weight for about three weeks. It's about 187 now. And um, although my, I'm just losing inches everywhere. So, you know, it's probably muscle. And I'm not going to get freaked out because, you know, my, look, my husband sees me more than I see myself. And he's like, you are definitely shrinking. And it's hard for me to see myself, you know. I mean, like, you all see me on this video in a truer light than I see myself, because I still see, you know, not positive images in my mind. That's what I'm really working on, too, to kind of, like, you know, focus on what's positive and, and the progress that I've made and to keep doing that. And so I encourage you to do the same. Let me get off here. Um, this is the spinning manual that I've been studying. I mean, it's a really fascinating story, too. It's, started by an endurance athlete who, because of, you know, he had a baby and wanted to stay at home more, and then because of the spinning um, training, he ended up winning a cross-country road race. And uh, it's, the history of spinning is really interesting, and so I'm really grateful that he started that because it's, it's definitely different than being out on my mountain bike or being out on a road bike. It's definitely... Uh, you know, that, that focused training session while you're in the gym, um, really focusing on your heart and your legs and so forth. It's really, if you haven't tried a spin class, try it. It's really, it's an amazing thing. So, I gotta get to work. Um, I just wanted to check in with you and let you know how I'm doing. And this is, it reminds me of the time that, you know, in my 20s when I became a whitewater rat guy just for fun on the weekends. And I had forgotten that I had done that, you know, and um, when you're not really an athlete, like I wasn't brought up as an athlete in my family, and it's just it's kind of neat to 
Like I was in front of a bunch of athletes today. You know, they're all, I live in western North Carolina and they are all hardcore in this area. So it was really neat to be able to serve them and contribute to them. You know, I was sitting a guy this morning and talked to him about the safety of, you know, where the handlebars should be and stuff. And it was really, it was really cool. So let me know how you're doing and I will check in and I will also have some more um, cooking demos coming up uh, with fast food from the farmer's market. Bye.